Hi, I'm James, and after a bit of a hiatus, we're back taking a look at Dirt 4 running on Intel HD 620 graphics on the Core i3 7100U processor. Um, we've tested this at a couple different graphics settings. The game actually auto detected 1366 by 768 and medium detail. Um, I went straight for dropping that down to low as. Um, I felt performance wasn't quite good enough. It didn't actually make a huge difference. I think it went from about 25 to 28 frames per second, sometimes a little less than that, as we can see here. Um, and at these settings, the game's just about playable. Um, unfortunately, I'm playing on a controller here and on the simulation mode, so my inputs are rather jerky. Um, but, you know, the frame rate is just within that realm of playability. Um, but what we look at next is dropping down to the 720p resolution and the ultra low detail settings in a few moments. And so with these uh, changes, frame rates take sort of a 33 to 50% increase. So we're getting into a range where we are consistently running over uh, 30 frames a second. As you can see, I'm still doing pretty poorly with the controller. But things are just that little bit smoother. We're constantly over 30 frames a second. And I think if you're wanting to play this game sort of seriously on a KB Lake Ultrabook, these are the settings that you're going to be looking at using. Um, just because it makes sure you're staying above 30 frames a second, things are just a tiny bit more consistent. The game definitely does look poorer for it, but I choose, um, because it, you know it's a driving game, I choose having that responsiveness um, over sort of graphical fidelity in this case for these kinds of systems. I hope you found this video useful. If you'd like to see more from us in the future, be sure to hit the subscribe button. We've got plenty more videos we're sure you'll enjoy as well, looking at gaming on other platforms. Thanks for watching.